Yo, what is up guys? Zorin here with another Pokemon and Scarlet and Violet VGC video. Hope you guys are doing well. Now today we are bringing you a team with Dialga featuring Tyranitar and Excadrill. I haven't played with these two in a bit so I kind of wanted to give them a go since I saw this team on the Pokesports Discord. And it also has Sylveon so it's, there's a lot of spice here. We got a Raccoonit here for wide card. We've got Sylveon here for some fairy hyper voicing action with throat spray we've got tyranitar here with the clear amulet you know doing tyranitar things and, and we got excadrill as well with the sand rush to take benefit of that sandstorm it's always nice to have weather anyways even if it's not like the main thing but we do have excadrill to abuse that weather we do have indity here as well for tyrain control as well which is nice so yeah dirt dirt over here making sure that he has answers for everything basically because you got sands you got sandstream for the weather the most common weather being sun and rain so you're not really going to be getting contested with the sand and if they do have sand well great because you can bring extra drill to abuse it you got indity here to, to um stop those maridons and those rillaboons with its psychic surge giving you the advantage and making it so they do less damage output on your mons you got a raccoonid here with the white guard to stop you know glacial land shadow like terra star storm all that good stuff so you have like you have options right you have a lot of different like ways to deal with with all the kind of stuff that you'll see in in the game except for like i think the only thing that you probably won't be able to deal with too well but you can still you can still beat but it's probably going to be very tough is um is amazenta so amazenta seems like the the biggest the biggest fear for this team. Diaga does have Earth Power. You do have High Horsepower and High Horsepower on the Excadra and Tyranitar. But um, remember, his body. He, um, some of this is a very bulky mon, so unless he could take care of it really fast, it can get out of hand. But we'll see what happens. Hopefully, we don't even run into Zamazenta. That'd be great. But, anyways, guys, if you guys want to try out the team for yourselves, the rental and the Poke page will be in the description below for you guys. Thank you, Dirt, for the team. I really do appreciate um, seeing Tyranitar and Excadra being used here. Uh, shout out to big to to AJ here because he all you know this is like a little a little shout out to him because he loves using Tyranitar and Excadrill. Big homie and Lil Homie. They're spiritual successors over here. But anyways guys, hope you guys enjoy the video. Make sure to like and subscribe and make sure seriously make sure to subscribe because if you guys are liking my VGC content, why not just subscribe? There's no reason not to. You guys are already watching. There's a, there's like 80% of you watching that aren't subscribed. So come on guys. Help me out here. Help me out here. It'll, it'll, it really does help. Anyways, guys, let's get straight into it now. I, I'm done yapping. I want to find some matches. Let's okay, go. so we have a we have a Lunala. Okay, that Lando. I, I really hope that thing doesn't have low kick. That King Gabbard having low kick would make me very very sad. Ah, oh. Tyrant looks pretty good here though. But I don't think we bring Excadrill, or maybe we do. Hold on, let me look at Excadrill real quick. Mm. I don't like extra Joe in this one. I do not. I think I like Tyranitar here. Indeed, is kind of nice here too. A Raccoonet's nice for the uh, Rillaboom kinda and the the Lando a bit. The Sylveon kind of covers me there too. I think we'll go with Sylveon. We'll go with with these two I guess hmm you know what I'll bring I'll bring this in the back we'll bring we'll bring this in the front instead oh there we go that's what I wanted we'll bring Diago in the back in the front with the Tyranitar because I think Tyranitar is going to be really good here bar the Lando and the uh, Urshi but we'll see what happens we will see what happens. I don't know, I reckon it kinda looks good here too though. I'll be honest. Yeah, there's the, there's the two that I was really not wanting to see. Okay. Well that's a little bit rough. That's hecka rough. Um I might have the Terra here. But not not this thing. Ew. These were the two that I did not want to see. Uh, I can't protect. That's the thing, right? 
I think I'm just gonna switch into Indeedee here. I'm probably gonna have to Terra here. Good Terra too. Let's go for a Trick Room. I don't know if it's Trick because what's in the back might might make it really hard. Nah, we'll, we'll Trick Room. I think it's fine. I will Trick Room here. That was a really bad lead on my part, that's for sure. Maybe sh maybe it was Sylveon. Sylveon, Sylveon in with Indidi would have been fine. It covered everything, didn't it? Yeah, that was actually the Indidi Sylveon was actually the play here. It covered everything, Even including Rillaboom and every. Yeah, I should have done that. Oh, okay, that's perfect. And I'm Water Terror, so if this goes into Water Surging Strikes, go into okay. No, oh, that's. Actually, that's really weird. He had a really good, like, turn there. Uh, it's Rillaboom. Oh, well, that's not good, because he's taking a oh. So Rillaboom's in the back. Oh, that's not good at all. That is very not good. It's Rillaboom. Because now I can't stop his uh his thing, right? If I protect, I don't have protect, do I? I don't. It's definitely just a fake out here. I'm just gonna go for a luring voice then. I don't know. Try to get some chip damage onto it. I just go for like Dragon Pulse on this. I just I think I, I didn't bring the right four. That's all. Why is he terrestrializing? What 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 is he fearing on 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 the Alga? What is what is he fearing on the Alga that that could potentially threatening him, threaten him? Is this man confusing it with Palkia? Yeah, he is going for that, okay. The damage at least, like... I was hoping I would get like, something off. Okay, that didn't... That didn't help me out at all. Okay. That's fine though. I mean, it's not fine because Water Terra kind of screws me over here. At this point, I kind of just let Tyranitar go. Cause he's just gonna grassy glide me, right? Cause what do I do here? I should have let Sylveon in DV. I think that would have been better. Would have been such a better spot here. I'm gonna try to get this guy off. Jet does nothing. Oh. We do no damage. We do no damage. Because he's probably going for Woodhammer here, right? Yeah. Woodhammer and then into Sludge Bomb. This is a really bad matchup for me, as as per usual when I when I match match make into this. But I think I should have went into the into the Sylveon would have been really good, like really really good. I pretty much just lose here now. Maybe. I mean, there's a shot. But I'm pretty sure what's his face is in the back, right? Should have his his restrictor should be in the back. That should be his last mon. Which is probably what's coming out, to be honest. That Lunala's coming out. I mean, I just keep going for Hyper Voice here, and I'll just go for a knockoff. I think that's my best best play here. Yeah, he's gonna protect, so that's why... I, I mean, I, I had a feeling he would protect that thing, so I was like, huh? 
Hyper Boys here. Into knockoff. I think Tyranda could still kind of like win this. Yep, we're slower. Take it out. Nice! Good job, Tyranitar. That's what we wanted to see. But if Trickon goes down this turn, I kind of lose. <laughs> I'm not sure. I think this is. I think we're on like at the final final turn. We'll see right now. Yeah, we have one turn. Okay, we have one turn. They could detect. But if they have U-turn, they they're not detecting. If they have U-turn, they're not detecting. That's that's what I'm I'm getting from this. Because I think I just go for like rock slide here and pray. He got the double protect. Are you kidding me? Oh, that's so unfair. That's actually so unfair. We actually came through. We, we actually came back too. That's the sad part. Now, do we go for rock slide or do we go for high horsepower? That is the question now. Because clearly now we have to deal with um, with this, right? I mean, they both miss. <laughs> I just realized that they both miss. And yeah, we just hype. He he he. One hundred percent goes for the uh, for the Sylveon. I think. I think we knock off. I think knock off is fine here, actually. I think I think Tyranna could take one hit. I think. Up there's the Sludge Bomb. Because he had to go for the Sylveon there. Sylveon was the bigger threat. He was hoping that Tyranna can't hurt him. I guess. Oh, critical hit! Yeah, Tyranitar pulled through. I'm telling you, <laughs> Tyranitar, man. You can always, you can always rely on Tyranitar for everything. But I think, yeah, my lead was so bad though. I could have led um, Sylveon in Diddy, and I would have been really fine. But it is what it is. We still got through. We still made it. We still managed. We still managed. So that's good. All right, GG. Okay, okay, okay. What are we bringing here? I think Tyranitar comes out for sure. Mm, not really. <laughs> not really, actually. Turn is nice just because you can like take away that sash in case that Chen Pao has its sash, but then it's like, what do I do afterwards? Hmm. But it's definitely Maridon coming out. I feel like Hands comes out too, though. Hands comes out maybe with the uh, Ursaluna. Why are we running into Trick Room teams when I'm running kind of like half Trick Room? I think I, I think I could just go Sylveon here then. I don't think it's Tyranitar this time. I think it's Sylveon. Tyranitar's good though. Not really. It could just be these two. Bring the Alga in the back with a Raconid. Because a Raconid kinda kinda looks nicer too. Maybe not. Hmm. A Raconid or Excadrill here. It might be Excadrill. What do I have? The thing is, Ursaluna is most likely coming, and then if I don't have anything for Ursaluna, I kind of just lose. So I think this is just safer. I think this is just safer. I could have also gone Diago Sylveon, I think. That might have been fine too. But we'll see. That's Urshifu, what's his face? Okay. He's probably gonna like U turn out or something. Put up Trick Room. I could see that happening. I don't know if Sylveon can take a Surging. Because switching into a Raquinid wouldn't be a bad idea here. Setting me up for that Ursaluna switch. Because I feel like Ursaluna comes in here right now. Or Maridon. Maridon could come in too, but I don't think Maridon ever comes into this. I'm gonna go for a, 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 a helping hand. Should I? Nah, I'll go for follow me for now. I don't know. I, I don't know the calc. Yeah, there you go. See? I don't want to deal with that. Heck no. 
Helping hand surging strikes would definitely KO my Sylveon. I am not letting that happen. Oh, that KO. Oh, that doesn't KO. Wait, are we are we sashed? Oh, we're definitely sashed. No way, we're not. Oh, we're Rocky. Wait, yeah, we're Rocky Helmet. Hold, because I I kind of forgot the item on on Indity. We're Rocky Helmet with one living on one inch. Bro, that is clutch. That's ex oh, you're not gonna like this. I mean, sure, you could you could take it you could take it away. I I don't mind. Electro seed, okay. That's funny. That's so funny. Oh, that's so funny. Oh my god, that is the funniest thing. We get the critical hit too. Okay, this is the funniest match that I've ever been in. Bro brought in the right on now just to get it obliterated. That is actually hilarious. We still have Araquanid in the back too. Don't forget that, we have Araquanid in the back. Actually goes back out. I think I, I, I think I just hyper voice here and go for um follow me again. I, I can't risk that helping hand hitting hitting me yet. We're at one HP. I'm not risking that. <laughs> Indeed, he coming in clutch though with that U-turn survival. Holy. Yeah, you can do that. I don't I don't even know why you would go for that. Or, isn't Ursaluna not in the back? Yeah. I mean, what did you expect? You do you expect me to follow me after? Did you expect me to like after you showed me you had helping hand? You, you expect me to let you just helping hand surging strikes my my Sylveon for free? Like no, I'm putting that one HP <laughs> survival to use. Like there's no way I'm gonna let you have my Sylveon for free. All right, GG. Okay, well they have a trapper. Oh, that's not gonna be fun. Oh, that's not gonna be fun at all. They have a trapper. Ugh. I think I'm gonna go Arachnid here and go in DD. Oh, Sylveon in the back, and we're leaving. We're leaving these two off in the back. I don't see them. <sighs> like Tyranitar is kind of good here. It's, it's just Diago. Diago is actually so awkward here. It's it's funny because Diago is actually super awkward here as a as a <laughs> as a as a restricted is actually pretty bad. The thing, the amount of things that I don't want to bring it into, because the only thing that it hits here is the Sylveon. Tyranitar is actually better here, isn't it? Oh, Tyranitar is 100% better here. I'm actually gonna do that. I'm gonna bring Tyranitar. I'm not bringing, I'm not bringing Diago. Diago so ass, man. <laughs> it's actually sad because I actually feel like Tyranitar is just like the better one to bring here. Diago is actually hindering me here. Because it doesn't do anything. It does... It has Earth Power, it has Flash Cannon. Flash Cannon is the only thing for the Sylveon, which is nice. But it's like... I don't know. Talifan is Calyrex, okay. Oh, wait. Oops. That is not what I wanted to bring. I thought I went, um... I ran tar. Ooh. That's not good. I thought I went to Ranatar here. Oh, I thought I went Tyranitar. Whoops, I didn't. I didn't choose him properly. Tyranitar Lee would have been really good here. I. That's why I wanted to go Tyranitar. Ah, I messed up. I messed up. I think I can still go into Tyranitar though. Tyranitar's like my win con here. Oh, I messed up. Oh, I messed up. <laughs> I messed up on, on... I didn't even pay attention. I thought I brought it. Brought it in the back. Whoops. My brain just mushed right there. Because Tyranitar Indity would have been super good here. Because then I could just go for like Rockside Trick Room. What is he going for? Power Pond? Okay. That's fair. Although weird... Okay, we got the sandstorm kicking up. Oh my god, he has pollen puff on this one. This one has to be spe it has to be specs. This thing is specs. It's a it's a hundred percent specs. I ran into the specs one again. Constantly running into the specs one. Ooh. 
Ooh, boy. This has to be specs. There's no way it isn't. I'm just gonna- oops, that's not what I wanted to do. I'm just gonna go for leech life. I think rock slide is fine here. I lost my trick room setter though. I really hope he's he's choice specs, otherwise I'm I'm losing my Taranta right here. I'm hoping to God he has choice specs. Okay, that's fine. I was going for rock slide anyways. Yeah, he, he's a hundred percent specs, okay. Yep, that specs damage for sure. Oh, come on, man! Just me, just... And it's the one that I needed him to hit! More! Come on, man! I need... Oh my god! We would've been so fine! We would've been so fine, dude! We would've been so fine! I even cursed. That's how, that's how mad I am. That's how mad I am. We would've been fine. Oh my god, dude. Now what do I do? Dude, this thing would have been gone. Oh, I'm so mad because I... What do I do now? He has to switch though, right? He has to switch. He's not going to go for it, for it, right? Yeah, he switches. Please don't follow me. Yeah, that, that's what I was predicting. Yup, I predicted that at least. Tyranitar, if you just hit Rock Slide like, like you're supposed to, we wouldn't have this issue right now. I went for Protect just in case though. Just in case. Oh my god, thank god. But I don't know how we're gonna deal with this Ogre Pond. I'm pretty sure I'm in range of of, of IB Kajal too. 100% am. Oh, okay. This thing's coming out. Is this this darker Shifu? Uh, darker Shifu is scary. Not gonna lie. I'll go into Sylveon. Darker Shifu is indeed scary here. He hasn't terrored either, that's the thing. Yeah, there's the wicked. Oh, that's so much. Yeah, there's the horn each. I think we lose here. And it's because this dumb Tyranitar decided, you know what, I'm gonna miss Rock Slide. Rock Slide didn't like like my, my play was perfect, man. Rock Slide into into Leech Seed, predicting the follow me was like big. And now I can't do anything. I just lose. Like, what do I do? I ha I had a way out, and Tyranitar decided to lose it for us. Because we didn't have Trick Room anymore. Man. We had this, too. Once we knew it was Specs, we had this, and then Tyranitar just blew it. What's the point of that Terra? Like, even... Even then, like, he just, he could have just, like, not done that and won. I can't protect against Urshifu. I kind of just have to let him have it. Like, I get it, it's to finish out Sylveon, but I'm pretty sure the choice specs, Ghost Terra, Calyrex in the back would have finished me off anyways. There's, there's like, nothing I could do. My only, my only hope was um, hitting that. Yeah, because so, so, so what would happen is that even if I lose, like even if I um, 
I take out Ogre Pond thanks to the Rock Slide Leech, Leech Life. And the next turn, he's, he has Urshifu. What's his face? Tevin could have cleaned up. Tevin could have definitely cleaned up. Oh my god, man. Always with the misses. Oh man. This is going to be my last one for sure. Because I am I am sick of this right now. Rockside has 90% accuracy. How do I miss? Or is it 80? Is it 80? Why does it like miss the, the, the target that I need to not miss on too? How does that happen? Like every single time. How is that so accurate? With how it works. Oh, this guy has the dumb wheezing too. But you see what I mean though? Tiago was actually super useless in that in that matchup. We actually would have won if we just didn't um get screwed over there. Um Like Diago could be good here. Hundred percent could be. Uh let's see. So what do we bring here? How good is Sylvie on here? Kinda good. It's kinda good. What what Terra is it? Ground, no, that's not good. <laughs> that's terrible. Uh I'll go with these two. Put these two in the back. Maybe it's good. Oh man, that last game tilted me that I cursed. My bad about that. I didn't. Mean, I don't like cursing on my videos, so that was really bad. It was one of those um, under my breath curses, but even then, it was just so bad. Cause it, cause so if it if it if it didn't hit the the shadow rider, I would have been okay with that. But it hit. It missed the one that I needed to get rid of. That was like my biggest issue with the uh, or my Araquanid. Okay. He can taunt me. Yeah, he can taunt me. I'm just gonna do this then. Oh. I could have trick room then. What's coming out? Dragonite, okay. I could have trick roomed. Oh, that still did so much damage though. Ah. Uh... That secret sword looking mighty scary right now. I don't know if I can live a, a hit now. I might have to Terra here. <laughs> I put myself in a bad spot. I should have Trick Room, but I thought, you know... He might have Taunt. Might do it. Uh, you know what, I'll, I'll do it. There's no point in just carrying anymore. He might protect that. I'm gonna actually liquidation this slot. We didn't Terra. You might just be focusing the the Diaga down then. We're just we're just fine, I guess. I and mean, I didn't really need the Terra for it. I mean, Sylveon can't use it; it's ground type. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. Well, this KO. Ha <laughs> ha! Okay, we're cooking. Oh yeah, we cooking. Okay, we get the Trick Room up anyways. Nice. Oh, we cooking. Not really, but it does help a bit. Is that what we have in the back? Do this thing again. I think I keep switching to Sylveon here. Which is a Sylveon? Yeah. Yeah, switch it to Sylveon. Go for a leech life on this. Might be fine. Uh 
probably not. Yeah, there's a sucker. Are we slower? Yeah, we are. Nice. I don't have protect on that thing, so I had to go for this. I think that worked out just fine. We're getting rid of all his priority, that's really, which is really nice. I was banking on a rack when it being slower than wheezing, that's why. Dazzling gleam, okay. Cool. Um I'll go into Tyranitar here. Cause he had Caloric Shadow Rider, right? Yeah. He hasn't Terra either though. That's one thing to to remember. We do have Shadow Ball though. But I think I'm gonna go for a uh, Hyper Ball into a uh, high horsepower into this. Might be fine. I, I kind of need to be aggressive because the moment it, my, my trick room runs out, I lose. But I kind of have to be really aggressive. I'm pretty sure Sylvan could take one hit, maybe. Or probably not. Honestly, I don't think so. I think his best play is to just, for, just to go Astro Barrage. And if he has Sludge Bomb, I, I, he might not even have Sludge Bomb. He might have Dazzling Gleam as his only move. And then have like Taunt Protect. Will-O-Wisp, maybe. Oh, Will-O-Wisp. Yeah, Will-O-Wisp is probably what, what he has in the back right there. Yeah, that's why I didn't want to go for the for the move. Oh, thank God I went for Hyper Voice. Oh, thank God I went for Hyper Voice. Why did that do no damage? Oh, because of the thing, right. Oh, right. I have to get rid of this thing somehow. That does nothing, but... Oh, so close. Oh, so close. Oh, this is bad. This is so bad. You live this, right? And yeah, you live it. Barely, but you live it. <sighs> what do we do here? I don't know if Rock's like KOs. I think he protects. 100% protects here. Yikes! I don't have a way to de de to stop this. Yep. I went for Rock Slide because um, High Horsepower misses too. But this is at least stab. Please, 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 please don't miss again. Please don't miss again. Okay, thank God. Thank God, okay. That was my best play, yeah. I had to go for a Terra Blaster. I, I mean, I guess I guess. No, I had to go for Terra Blaster because it spread, right? Okay, nice. So here we just go for a Terra Blast into. Oh. Alright, thank you, Zaka, for subscribing. I appreciate it. Yeah, we just win this. Yeah, we won. Oh, man. <laughs> I forgot that. The <laughs> I forgot about the. I forgot about the mist and I went for hyper voice. <laughs> I mean, it worked out, it worked out. I went for it anyways because it's like they're usually fairy tarot anyways, and I was expecting a fairy tarot. But it works out. Alright, GG. Alright, well, that's gonna be the end of the video for sure. Again, apology for that little swear cur that little swear work coming out of me that stepped out. I was angry with Tyranitar right there. Right there. <laughs> but Tyranitar did clutch up so many of the battles, so I can't even be mad at it. It clutched up the last one, it clutched up the... I think it was the first one, I forgot. But it clutched up some battles, so I can't even be mad. There is a glaring ground weakness and nothing to really cover you with it, so your really only option is a Raquinid to cover your ground weakness, so if they somehow did just predict it and get rid of it, then that thing's not gonna have fun. And Arachnid being the only one that kind of covers you is kind of bad. It, it's kind of like, it's it's awkward because you kind of want Indeedee as well to kind of like protect you. But then you don't, you, sometimes you can't even bring Indeedee and Arachnid at the same time. So it is kind of awkward sometimes. 
But I mean, it's still pulled through. And the rock slide, if the rock slide didn't kill, we would have been, we would have been in so much trouble. But that's why I went for rock slide over high horsepower. Because if I didn't, and high horsepower probably doesn't KO because it's not stab. They needed to be stabbed. So that was really, really big there. And the hyper voice was needed because I need to throw, get the throw spread activated to do even more damage. But all in all, it did good. We did, we did well with it. Dialga really didn't do anything. I'll be honest, it did nothing. It did absolutely nothing in, in, in this team. I think I think the rest of the team did better at <laughs> Diago, which is hilarious. I think you could literally put all all five all six, um all five of these mons together and put some Azenta in the in, in there if you if you want to commit to the the ground weakness and still and still do better. I'll be I'll be quite honest. I think I think some Azenta would be like the better slot here, which is which is kind of sad, kind of kind of sad because like like you have Tyranitar Excadrill for um speed and you have like trick room on the ndd already you could probably like put trick like find something you know it's weird but either way guys thank you guys for watching hope you guys enjoyed the video and i'll see you guys in the next video make sure to like and subscribe guys i'll see you guys in the next video peace